Hi YouTube, Natalie here, and today I am doing another Kipling video. <laughs> As you guys can see, I cannot stay away from these wonderful Kipling mini backpacks. I am a true sucker for anything that Kipling puts out that's in mini. <laughs> so let's get right into it. Here is the Delia Compact, and it is, I want to say, the replacement for the mini Albers since they do not make that bag any longer. I have two mini Albers, one in black and one in that beautiful floral rush color that I cannot stop carrying. But here is my black mini Albers so you all can see the size difference. The mini Albert is just a wee bit tinier than the Delia Compact. And I will do a little bit more comparisons to that mini Albert a little bit later, but let's get into this beauty. So Kipling has a bunch of collaborations that they do each and every year. And I have been stalking the Kipling website so much so that I was on when they actually released the Little Mermaid, uh, <laughs> The Little Mermaid collaboration. I have to laugh because, Natalie, you need to do something else besides stalk these websites. But anyway, Macy's also carries Kipling, okay? They have a Coca-Cola collaboration and they also have a Disney collaboration. And sometimes Macy has, Macy's has the bags and sometimes they do not. This time they had the bag. So if you look on the Kipling website, I believe this bag is $128. And right now they have it discounted at $68, I believe. Don't quote me on that. I'm just going off my memory. But I actually got this bag for $39 on a flash sale, I want to say, last Sunday on Macy's. So let's get into this beauty right here. So I love this bag and I did not think I would, but I had to order it when it was only $39, right? <laughs> so the reason why I say I did not think I would is because this has some things about it that are not traditional Kipling. And when I say that, you all know uh, Kipling is known for their zippers, right? Well, it does have the traditional zipper right here in this front pocket. But in this pocket here, let me set the bag down. In this pocket here, it does not have the traditional zipper. And also, there is a lip over the zipper. And I'm not sure what that's for. I guess protection. But the Mini Auburn does not have that lip over the zipper. And so it makes it very easy to access the bag. All right. And I like that about the Mini Auburn. I really do wish they would bring that back. But I digress. <laughs> so let me go ahead and get into this bag. This bag is made from PET bottles, recycled materials. So it is not the traditional Kipling nylon, but I could not resist. I could not say no to this bag just because it wasn't made in nylon. And there's a couple of reasons why I could not say no to this bag. Tell me this bag doesn't look like summer. <laughs> This bag looks exactly like summer. And, you know, Coca-Cola is one of my guilty pleasures. So I don't mind having a beautiful bag that has Coca-Cola blasted all over it. It also reminds me of my father who loves to drink cans of Coca-Cola. So even though I know it's not the best, I do love the fact that they made this collaboration and it's using 100% recyclable materials. So that helps me. <laughs> so let me go ahead and get into this bag. I want to start with the loop that you might use to carry the bag. So I like this loop. I can only get like one thumb in the loop. Sometimes I can get maybe two fingers into the loop. Whereas with the mini Alber, I can get four of my fingers into this loop, which I really enjoy that feature on the mini Alber. I wish that they had that on here, but you know, what can you do? <laughs> so now I'm going to get into the pocket here. So the pocket here is just like the pocket here in the mini Alber minus the flap. Right? There's a flap here. There is no flap. When I say flap, I mean this little magnetic flap that allows me to, sometimes I will put my mask in here. Sometimes I would also put uh, my earbuds in there as well. So in this flap here, let me show you what I have here. If I zip it open, I can fold it down. There is no lining in here. So that's another big difference that I spotted. 
Um, I'm not sure if it's just the Coca-Cola collaboration brand that has no lining or if it's all the compact Delia's. Maybe you could let me know in the comments. There was a lady in one of my previous videos who turned me on to uh, Delia Compacts, letting me know that it is the replacement for the mini Auber, but there is a complete lining in this one. So glad I got my Aubers is what I, what I can say. All right, so there is no lining here, but I am able to fit more items in this particular pocket than I am in the Auber, okay? So let me show you what I have here. I have my Sunnies. I have my Coach Wallet. <laughs> it's a little zip around wallet and I can fit my, my phone. So that is what I have in the front pocket, okay? Now, this big pocket here can fit substantially more items than the mini Auburn, okay? And I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing because I do try to pack light and I think I still have packed light in this bag. You be the judge. <laughs> so I'm gonna fold this down and show you that there is a lining here, okay? So there is actually a lining inside of the main compartment, which I was glad to see. So inside I have my keys. You all know what I'm about to say next, why I'm holding the keys like this, right? There is no key leash. Kipling. <laughs> I don't know why they're doing away with these key leashes, but it is making me very sad. So there is a key leash inside of the Auber, but not inside of the Delia Compact, okay? And so inside I have some tissues. I have, ooh, a receipt. <laughs> I have a gift card. And I have my mask right here. If I go further, you guys can see I have this lemon case, which is adorable. It is Kipling. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and open that up and show you all what's inside. I have some lotion inside of there. I have my little fidget cube. And I have some feminine products. So this is a nice little you know, miscellaneous bag to put things that you don't want floating around inside of your bag. Then I have, of course, you all have seen this in my past videos, this is the Creativity in Small. And so some of the things that I have in here, I'll just go ahead and show you all. I have deodorants, I have a mask, I have some Excedrin pills and a pill case, I have my charger, some gum. I also have in the center pocket, I have all of my little cards that do not fit inside of my little coach zip wallet, okay? So lots of items can fit in here. This is also another one of those little catch-all bags, just like the uh, lemon here. Next, I have my pen with the little sleeve here. I have my Target reusable bag. I love this, got this from Target. And then I also have my keys in this cute little Ikea bag. You all have seen this before. These are my keys to my car, my car and my husband's car, which are the push start cars. So I don't need to ever open up this little bag. It just needs to be on me. And so let me show you what the bag looks like in the inside. So that's what the bag looks like in the inside. Natalie, how are you showing this? <laughs> Okay, so in the inside, you can see there is the Coca-Cola tag with the Kipling lane, and then underneath the little shiny symbol. I also have a zipper part here. Inside the zipper part, I just have the cards and the receipt that I used to purchase this. So let me give you the exact price. Okay, it's not on here. I guess they ripped that off, okay. Well, <laughs> this is the little Coca-Cola tag that it came with. Now, I wanted to show you, so in the inside of the mini Auburn, there is a zippered part in the back as well, but then also there is a pocket on the front wall, and that is where I would put my cell phone. Since there is no pocket in this front wall, I am able to put my cell phone in this front pocket, which honestly, I'm fine with there not being a pocket here for my cell phone, because I have enjoyed using this zipper here. And this zipper is okay. I mean, <laughs> I'm telling y'all, I purely purchased this bag because of the way that it looks. It looks so cute for summer. And so that is why I purchased this bag. I am super satisfied with my purchase. Would I buy more Delia Compacts? Absolutely not, I would not. Because I feel like as time goes on, 
if Kipling isn't careful, they are ending up taking away a lot of the features that made me fall in love with the bag, such as the mini pockets, um, the organization on the inside of the bag, the key leash. So I don't know. I have to think about it, but I know I wouldn't get another Delia compact. Now, I wanted to also talk about the back because this is one feature that I actually like more than what's on the mini Auber. These are the straps. So these straps are so substantial. They really feel good. And I'm not sure if you're gonna be able to notice the difference between the way that these straps are and the mini Auber straps are. So the mini Auber is like this cotton web and this, I'm not sure of the material, probably polyester, right? <laughs> but the way that it feels on my body when I carry it, I promise you, when I get ready to carry this black one in the fall, I'm definitely going to take off these straps and put them on this one because it feels so comfortable. It feels so good. Not that these straps don't feel good, but these are better. <laughs> so that is my review on this wonderful Coca-Cola collaboration with the Kipling brand. I love this bag, despite some of the things that I told you were my cons. I am going to enjoy carrying this bag in, in the summertime and I am pleased with my purchase. Now, I would not be pleased if I paid full price, but I am definitely pleased having only paid $39. So I hope you all enjoyed this video. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to leave them at the bottom. If I forgot anything or if you you know of some other special features about this bag let me know thank you so much for watching youtube i also wanted to say that i will be going into the school building i want to say in a week or a half and i plan on doing a little bit of vlogging there because i know there are many of you all who follow me um, for my educational videos so i will be bringing that back thank you so much youtube bye Just popping in post editing and I realized that I forgot to mention some super important features of the bag such as this cute logo here. It looks so cool how they redid that logo. I love the white with the black on top. Just wonderful. Also the cute little red monkey and I wanted to show you all this little Coca Cola tag here. On the front, it says Coca-Cola. On the back, it says Kipling. And the most important feature of the bag that I forgot to mention is this detailing here. Looks like little Lego bricks, <laughs> if you ask me, but they actually described it on the website as like the pop effervescent feel that you get when you are drinking Coca-Cola. So I thought that was too cool to not mention it. Thanks, you all. Grace and peace.